Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Sharani. Today I'm going to show you how to make my easy pina colada pops. Before I get started, I wanted to show you the popsicle bags that I'm using. And I bought these off of Amazon. I'm going to leave it linked below for you if you're interested. And it comes with a lot of bags and I use them all the time. And I like it because it comes with this little funnel to fill it in the bag. They're just so cute and so perfect. Okay, so for this recipe, you're going to need 4 cups of ice. I'm going to use half of this can of cream of coconut, or 7.5 ounce. I wanted to use the whole can to make all of it, but my blender is not big enough, so I'm just doing 2 batches. As always, I'm going to have the exact measurements in the description box below for you. Next, you're going to need some pineapple juice and I'm just using this one from this can. And I'm using one cup of pineapple juice. And the very last thing is some white rum. And I'm just using Bacardi because that's what I have. If you don't have white rum, you can use dark rum. It doesn't matter, it just changes the color a little bit. But I prefer it with the white rum. Then all you gotta do is just blend it. If you're new to my channel, welcome and thank you for stopping by. If you haven't subscribed yet, I would appreciate it if you would consider subscribing. And be sure to click the notification bell so you know when I upload new videos. I just wanted to taste it to make sure it's good, you know, check if I have enough rum in there. <laughs> All you have to do now is fill it in a bag, and the bag has a line, it shows you where to stop, so don't fill it all the way. I almost fill it too much, <laughs> sometimes it's hard to stop. You might be thinking, girl, who have time to freeze those things? Just drink it like that. And yes, you can drink it like that. But I just wanted to freeze some for whenever I want some. I know you're probably tired of hearing me talk about how hot it is in Texas. But this is just so refreshing on a hot day. Right now the temperature says it feels like 105 degrees Fahrenheit outside. If you haven't been following me on Instagram yet, you can do so at Cooking with Shirani. I'm always sharing stuff in my stories over there, so come follow me. I forgot how many I got from that blender, but I think it was like a dozen. I'm not counting that half because I'm going to make some more and finish fill it up. So here we are with the next batch. I'm going to have pina colada pops for days. Well, I don't know. I mean, you never know what you need. <laughs> I'm going to put them in the freezer and I'll come back and show you what they look like tomorrow. Well, 
here they are the next day. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited about these. Ah, oh, I wish I could share with you guys. The next day, it still wasn't as frozen frozen, but it was still good. You know, it needed more time to freeze. So yeah, you just have to cut the top off and enjoy. If you prefer it in a glass, you can just run it under some water and it will melt up really quick and then just pour it in your glass. Well, I really hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Every thumbs up helps to get my videos out there. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't yet subscribed, please don't forget to do that. And I'll talk to you in my next one. Take care. Bye.